Hi guys, it's coffee time. And now we wait four minutes for this to steep. Steep's not the right word. I already read this part. What can I spell with the letters I A U G T S L? Say she. I think it's been four minutes. My coffee didn't really turn to coffee because my grounds weren't floating around. That sucks. Not making your coffee strong enough? Your coffee machine not working well? That's a first world problem. If you want to see good examples of first world problems, by the way, go to Twitter and uh, look for the hashtag first world problem and, and it's just people complaining about, basically what they are is, is people complaining about things and then realizing as they're complaining about them that it's not really something you need to complain about. It's, this isn't something that should concern you, but it does. Hmm. Speaking of Twitter, if you want to sort of follow me and these weekly vlogs aren't enough Lindor for you. First of all, I don't think that's the case for anybody, but if it is, you can follow me on Twitter at www.com slash, no, www.twitter.com slash Lindor. If you want to do that, you can do that. That's cool. If you don't want to do that, I understand. Guess what I got? Da 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 da! The Game of Thrones books. Well, I mean, the A Song of Ice and Fire books, but if you are not watching Game of Thrones, why not? Really, just watch it. Don't watch it with kids though. It's not a kid's show. It is not, I repeat, a kid's show. Sex, violence, rock and roll, ing of heads. It's not a kid's show. Basically what happened was, was I have been watching Game of Thrones and it has been blowing my mind and it has been spectacular and everything about it has been excellent and every character is so... just... You, so... There's so much about you just, it's just, you really, you, you really have to watch it. And if you do watch it, awesome. And some of you have, pro have, have probably read the books. See how flustered I'm getting? It's because I, I just love it so much. <sighs> I just wanted to buy the books, I wanted to read the books, but I didn't want to ruin the show for me. And I wanted to experience it brand new. And then the season ended. And I realized that I would have to wait almost a year to see the next season, First World Problem, and to get more of the story. And pretty much that night, I just went on to Amazon and ordered the books. I don't think I would have survived the summer without seeing spoilers. It is of no fault of the people who have already read the books. They have already read the books. They're just discussing the books. So it is of no fault of theirs. Honestly, it's my fault for even looking up anything about Game of Thrones but I can't help it because it's just so good. So I'm going to read the books and prevent myself from seeing any more spoilers because I've already seen quite a few. But before I begin reading A Game of Thrones, I need to start or rather finish reading The Amber Spyglass, which is the final book in the His Dark Materials series. I actually also have a PDF of it and I have been reading the PDF um, because I didn't have my book on me. I have my PDF on here, so I was reading that, and so um, I don't actually know what page I'm on. I could never have an ebook 
reader and I would never use it. I love books. I love how it feels holding a book. I love the smell of them. I love the accomplishment you feel when, you, when you're holding a huge section of the book in your hand and you're like, I've already read this much of the book and I have this much to go. And you just feel more accomplished and just it doesn't hurt your eyes when you read it and the page turning and the putting in of the bookmark or whatever you have as a bookmark, mine's just a piece of paper. It's just so much more satisfying than holding a screen in front of your face and being like, uh, it's gonna take me a while to finish The Amber Spyglass. I'm enjoying it, but it's gonna take me a while just because I read slow. Lee. Then I have to start this, and this has about 800 pages in it, so by the time Game of Thrones comes back for season two, I probably won't even be done this book, but I just need more of the story. I need it. I need to ingest this. And don't forget, I still need to make a video um, to celebrate my 250 subscribers, and I'll be doing that soon-ish sometime. If you have not put in your idea, go to my YouTube channel at youtube.com slash lindorvlog and put in your idea just down in the little section that looks like this. There have already been some in there. If you can't think of an idea, vote for one of the other ones. It'll be good times. Good times. Good times. Cheers.